Hi folks, isn't this a beautiful backyard? Isn't this gorgeous? This is a very good customer of mine. And they bought a tree from me a few weeks ago. Well, about, actually about a month ago, right Sharon? Yes. And they called me about an hour and a half ago. And this is the tree here. It's a purple leaf uh, redbud. Gorgeous tree. But she was concerned because as you can see, it's wilting badly. And of course, when I got the call, I thought, hmm, I wonder why, because it's such a good tree. Came in a pot, means all the roots came with it. Why would that thing wilt when it had been growing so good in that pot for years? So anyways, I'm gonna show you why. And this is a good lesson for everybody who plants trees. I'm gonna hand my phone to Sharon, and Sharon's gonna actually pan in to the tree, and we're gonna show you why. I'm gonna lift the root right out of the hole and it's very heavy and I'm gonna set it here. Now Sharon's gonna show you the bottom of the hole. Notice the water laying down there. With all the rains that we've had, we've, uh, we've experienced this a few times now and it's been too much rain and the tree is drowning, believe it or not. Everybody thinks that trees die because they get lack of water or they, they don't get enough water. But actually a tree can die, especially on a year like this year, as often when there's too much water in the hole. And this tree was sitting in saturated soil. It actually smelt bad when we pulled it out of the hole. So the resolution to this problem is we're gonna come back tomorrow with lots of sand, some earth, and we're gonna build the area up and we're gonna plant it on a mound, okay? And I thought this would be a prime time to take a picture or take a video of a problem that can occur when you plant a tree because it's very good education for everyone. And uh, if you have this problem, rectification is to build the area up so that it's on a mound so that the water can run away, okay? Um, please call us if you ever see a problem with your trees that you purchased at the glass house. But this is a very good lesson for everybody. I thought it'd be a prime opportunity to take a video so that we can all learn. Thank you very much. Dave from the glass house.